All right, guys, I've got an 89 Silverado, and I'm doing an LS swap. I'm changing over to a 2002 LQ9. Um, <clears throat> so basically, to do the to get the speedo to work on the gauge cluster, you've got to swap from 88 to 91. You got to use the newer style gauges. I went ahead and got a 94 gauge because it's got the tack. So basically, I'll show you how to do that if you're doing an LS swap um, and going away with the drag and not using it. Uh, so basically, everything's going to be the same color-wise. Uh, it's all pretty much the same. The only thing different is on the new plug, you've got three power wires. So you'll just tie them all into the one on the harness. And then you've got two ground wires. So just tie all those in to the one on the harness. Um, and then as for the tack, which is this white one right here, that white wire is going to go straight to the tack to the PCM. And then this is your speedo, this light blue black. This is going to go straight to your speedo. Um, as for the tack, your tack's probably not going to work at first. So what you're going to have to do is use HP tuners or whatever program you want to use. But on HP tuners, you'll adjust um, the tack setting to 3, and then your tack should function. Um, but then all these wires right here, I'm not going to be using anymore because these are for the DRAC module. Um, uh, let's see this brown one right here. This is going to be your cruise control Obviously not using that and I might later try to tie this one into the cruise control because I am doing drive-by wire um, But I'm not worried about that right now uh, this white black or white black wire right here is your ABS uh, Don't need it um, Your yellow wire right here is gonna be your VSS high the brown white is going to be your speedo positive. That black white right there is going to be your speedo ground. The purple is going to be your VSS low. And your brown white is going to be your VSS to ECM. Um, so these all go to the drag. And we're not using it in the 6L PCM. It's all built in. So you don't have to worry about that anymore. Um, <clears throat> But if you want me to go over these quick, I'll show you what they are. Most of them are all color-coded. Uh, the only one that's going to be really different on my 89, in the manual, it shows my fuel pump to be purple. And it's clearly pink. Um, but the fuel pump pink will go to the fuel pump purple on the new plug. Uh, but anyway... Uh, let's see if you start right here this blue right here is going to be your right hand turn signal this yellow is going to be your seat belt the purple is your fuel pump this gray right here is your dash light and then obviously right there the white is your tack the blue black is your speedo this dark green is your temperature sensor. And then this tan one, that's your oil. And then obviously the ones, your grounds and your positive right there that I went over already. Um, flip it over. And then you got your light green, which is your high beam. Then you got your blue, which is your left turn. And then obviously power again. And then you got your tan white which is your brake light your brown white which is your SES or check engine light um, then the last one is going to be your volt gauge which is brown but that basically sums it up I mean you're going to have to trim this away which it looks like crap because the only thing I could get in there was snippers I couldn't get any tools in there to cut it out decently um, I'll probably make it look a little better and then you'll have to trim this so your new plug will fit in there. <clears throat> but 
but that's basically it guys hope this helps